Welcome back to another video. It's your boy Local Stoic here with another top 11 video for your head top. And in this video, we have a super exciting match for you a Champions League fixture in which Nova FC is at home with Dream 1 1 FC. Now, Dream 11, they scored three goals at their home. So did we. So this game is going to be an exciting one. I can tell because they can score goals and so can we. Gonzalez is the first one in and he did not finish. Oh my god, Gonzalez did not finish. That could be crucial. Every single match, every single opportunity in this game counts. We cannot be affording to miss those chances. Itogo plays in Foglia. Foglio plays in the Tokyo. Long ball up to Tosic. Will he be able to finish? No, he will not. That was a very good attempt. Well played ball from Itoga to find Tosic. But, yeah. I'm saying we are playing a 3-2-3-2. They are playing a 3-1-3-2. So, it's just crazy, crazy times here. It's just crazy, crazy times here. Sing. Oh, cut that one out, Itoga. Well done. If you guys can see from the formation, we are playing a 3-2-3-2. Itoga playing a defensive role in the central midfield. O'Connor has the free role to do whatever. Both my wide players, they, we have a free kick. O'Connor with the first free kick of the game. And he does not get it in the back of the net, unfortunately. But our wide players are able to go forward. And we want Gonzalez to stay forward. So we put him in a particular position that allows him to stay forward. And... Huntley, as a striker, will play a more deeper role. This guy is dribbling through the goddamn midfield. He dribbled through the defense. And they managed to get ahead. Oh no. We need to do something fast here. We're playing long, mixed passing. And that's not doing us any good. So what shall we do? Defensive. That would be the only change we play. Manager showed up, guys. Dream 11's manager showed up. I'm way, way too excited about this one. Unfortunately, none of, the, none of my usual fans showed up, but that's okay. Oh, yes! Huntley with a strike. A beautiful goal from Huntley. That was what we needed. That was what we needed more than anything. Really get the boys involved in the game now. Taylor plays in Foglio. Cousins making a long run up. Huntley finds back Cousins. Cousins managed to find Tosic. And Tosic puts it into the side netting. Unbelievable. Tosic puts it into the side netting. We're going to switch to some short passes now. And maintain our... Should we go attack or possession? attack our possession let's go attack for the possession bonus we need to get more attacking going Foglio cuts back and takes the shot which finds the back of the net goalkeeper did not stand any chance that was a spectacular move by Foglio could not ask for more from our attacking midfielder which we I think we're going to give him some help drop one more player in the deep and allow him to get okay oh that was a good attempt from them we're going to drop Huntley in the deep with Foglio but no we're going to play him more advanced Foglio will play deeper and that we have two attacking midfielders and one striker with Gonzalez up top Gonzalez can he find him goes himself and finishes beautifully Gonzalez showing his prestige here at home at the Nova FC Stadium. Yes, we are loving it here, guys. We are loving how this game is going. Huntley, empty in the midfield. We are on the counter-attack. This looks like a counter-attack. 
this did look like a counter attack Foglio puts it wide oh my god he puts it wide good attempt from Foglio we'll keep it going boys we'll definitely keep it going but guys I hope you are enjoying the match so far this has been one of the most exciting Champions League fixtures that I have ever played well let me not say that Champions League semi-finals because I've never had a semi-final where we've we're on a six goal aggregate that we have to come at home and score before so I hope you guys are really enjoying this match they look like they, they did they, they did something coach said something to them at halftime they came out the game running short pass defensive next we're going to focus on some wings down the flanks for now cousins is on a yellow now we have to be very 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 careful it's a penalty oh my god they also got a penalty last game and so did we are we going to get a penalty as well we might have to get cousins off the pitch we don't want to risk getting a red but who are we going to take off we're going to lose two midfielders we can't lose the width foglio makes a wonderful dribble but does not finish unfortunately as i was saying we're gonna get some help for cousins we're gonna get gonzalez off and get our young defender in there Let's see what Foglio has to offer. O'Connor drives forward with a purpose. Gets away from his man. Cuts it in. And almost finishes. That was a good, a good, really, really good attempt here. We're going to get some help with Cousins in there. And our bonus, position bonus, we want to keep the ball. Maintain possession. And hopefully, Javid just tuning into the match here. Gonzalez takes it down nicely shields off his man and manages to get the shot away but doesn't finish that was that's a good effort from gonzalez we can get him off the pitch now we are not playing with any striker but we move foglio and tosic and move into a 4-4-2 defensive formation and i think just to coach out the game that's how we are going to finish oh my god that was so close I think a 4-4-1 is a better option. Yes, that offers Foglio the deep momentum to stay. The deep play, yes, it allows him to stay deep. And I think that's a good, better strategy. Oh, good strike from Okada. Keeper showed firm hands there. Yeah. 4 4 one, one is a much, much better option. But I don't want, I didn't want to go too defensive too early because that can also come back and haunt me especially if the game goes and they had the ball in this occasion it would be a mess Huntley Huntley beats his man with a ball roll goes wide to Tosic why did he go wide though Tosic pings it back into find Crombie and the volley goes wide from Crombie oh my god Crombie a little bit more control but we like to see our boys showing intent until the very last minute 88 minutes into the game can we oh no they have the ball they have the ball will they equalize on the last minute of the game top 11 are you going to pull a top 11 no crumbie managed to snuff that pass out and 88 minutes into the game nova fc 3-2 89 minutes come on victory is what we celebrate here at the nova fc stadium thank you guys for watching that match thank you guys for tuning into the video i hope you enjoyed that football because as i said this one was going to be exciting and as you can tell i am super super excited about this match because it was such a good match the first leg was a 3-3 thriller six goals exciting we had penalties we had red cards we had injuries this match more of the same penalties mad goals and yellow cards from both teams so from the statistics you guys can see that like come on they put in tackles we put in even more tackles fouls were there saves were there 
it was such a good match from both teams it was exceptional play from the manager he did come prepared unfortunately our home bonus proved just a little bit too much for him it was definitely down to the fans as the assistant manager said prior to the game and Nova FC walks away with the full three points and we move into the semi-finals of the Champions League to face off with Las Palmeiras now I can tell you that this semi-final is going to be a good one do not pay attention to the 71% because this guy has a quality team on his bench so i'm really looking forward to facing off with las palmeras because we know that we can beat them to get to the finals of the champions league no we are already in the finals of the cup that's not playing for another two days so we can rest and tomorrow in the league we face off with raymond this could be the title decider no i do not want to lose this game losing this game is basically losing the league for the season so we're definitely going to be prepared as be preparing as best as possible to face off with him because we need to get that full three points tomorrow so he can fall to second and we go to first place and as you can see goal difference it is neck and neck that's why i've been trying to score so many goals for the past couple of days in the league because i knew it was going to come down to this and raymond does not look like losing any match for the remaining of the season except the one that he's going to be playing tomorrow with nova fc so i hope you guys tune into that match tomorrow i hope you uh give that give that like button a smash because the season has been very exciting from start to finish I hope you guys have been enjoying the series so far hit the like button if you do subscribe to the channel for more and i'll see you in the next video local stoic sign out